Good. Uh, this morning we're here uh, at a customer's house. She wanted me to look at the electrical panel box, make sure all the connections are, are grounded, make sure the neutrals are tight, make sure the breakers are the right size, make sure there's no loose connections because uh, electricity vibrates. And as it vibrates, it causes a potential fire hazard. So what we're going to do, we start the main breaker. We're going to tighten up here. Be careful not to touch the rod. See how that's loose? This box is about 10 or 12 years old. So over time, things just work loose. So what we want to do, see how loose this is? Customers, several turns loose. Okay, that's the kind of stuff that starts fires right there. So I'm going to go down. This is a number 8 wire on a 50 amp breaker. That's good. Okay, this is a 10 wire on the 30, that's good. And you see how it's turned just a little bit. Also, this is copper conductors, which is what we need. This is a 12 wire, good, good. Every five to 10 years, I would recommend that you have a licensed electrician come to your house go through and do a safety check. The things you actually want the customers to look at with them is smoke detectors, GFIs, arc faults, aluminum wires, breaker sizes, because unfortunately we have a lot of handymen out there in the business that thinks they know how to do electrical work and a lot of times that creates problems for the owners and it creates fire hazards and it creates liability for the insurance companies because if you don't have a licensed electrician doing the work the insurance companies will not pay. So it's always best to use licensed contractors to do the work that you need done. So once again, I'm just going down through here. I'm tightening up the grounds, the neutrals, to ensure this lady has no issues. This thing is good. The wiring is good. Everything's good. This lady should be in good shape for, uh, for many years. If you have any questions, just call Jones Air Conditioning and Electrical, 239-596. 5855. Five.